What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So, I just finished shooting everything that you're about to see and hear for this amp comparison. And I just want to say that, man, this has helped me realize that comparing amps is hard. It's hard. Um, before I shot this video, I was like, you know, crawling around YouTube, checking out, seeing what I could learn from other uh, content creators. And a big dude who does this type of stuff is Mr. Lassie Lambert. I think I'm saying your name right. Um, and what did he do? He plugged into both of the amps. He played a couple of different guitars. He left everything at noon. He just went back and forth, played a couple of riffs, called it a day. And at first glance, it sounds like, man, that's super easy. That feels like low effort content. But in actuality, there's a whole bunch that goes into doing this. So you gotta realize, an amp has to have a load connected to it and all that sort of stuff. But anyway, um, my preliminary listening to these two amps beside each other is that the Thrasher comes out comes off as being very very bass heavy and not it's not as cool as the Satan generally speaking so I want to take a couple of minutes here real real quick and just play through both of them and just um, adjust a little bit and just kind of get them to what I think is close to their best selves you know so we're gonna start with where this the parts I just recorded ended with which has the Thrasher with shift in the bottom position, all the EQ and gain at noon, depth and presence at noon. Uh, boost is off. First thing is to want to lower the depth some. Let's increase the gain. So I have low frequency gain still at noon, but uh, gain is at overall gain is at one, and I just increased high frequency gain to like three o'clock. I feel like this amp is like base bassier than the Satan okay. is, and just straight in, it seems to benefit from having high frequency gain higher than low frequency gain. Just increase middle to about three and treble to about one. done a whole video on this amp. Essentially, my preferences for this amp is to run a boost in front of it and basically treat it like a rectifier. So let's do that. I'm going to reset the uh, all the gains back to noon. I'm going to reset everything to noon. And turn on my Aeros FX Proto Drive, which is down here. Alright, here's off. Everything except depth at noon. I still have a little bit of depth dialed out. Depth is at about 11.30. Pro drive is on. Some 
gain on the pro drive. the mid and back up to like three o'clock. I really like the middle control on this amp. And that's pretty much it. That's where, that's around where I find this amp comes to life. I, I appreciate this amp around right around these settings. All right, let's pull out the Satan and do the same thing. All right, guys, and like I said, here we are here with the Satan. Um, so I'm finding the Satan a little bit easier to love in this case, stacking it up against the, uh, the Thrasher. I like both the amps, obviously, but here's the Satan with everything at noon, no boost. <laughs> So I said I wanted to try and show them both at their best selves. This is fairly close to what I would call some of the Satan's best selves. The Satan has a whole bunch of best selves. That's what it seems like. Let's turn on kill. Kill off, slightly decrease the gain. Turn on my pro drive. Let's take Ola's advice and turn the Grind down just a bit and turn the girth up to three. So apparently just to make it flubbier and supposedly take overdrive better. I'm not gonna beat this horse. The, this amp sounds really great. And if I could only keep one of the, if I had to choose between the Satan and the Thrasher, I would choose the Satan, generally speaking. Like I said, I do think that the Thrasher pulls off the, uh, the pseudo rectifier thing a little bit better than the Satan does. But everything else about the Satan's general personality and character, I prefer. Um, still selling it though. I think so. 
hit me up before I change my mind. I have somebody who's um, supposedly checking it out Sunday. He may buy it then. If not, talk to me. But alright, hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. Let me know what you think. Uh, take care.